Hey guys! In today's video, I want to show you how to make reaction roles using Carlbot. This will be very useful to make our Discord server look better. People will be able to choose a specific role just by reacting a message. This can be using so people can get a role depending on their time zone, gender, age, or just to get a colored name. Let's begin. To do this, we will be using Carlbot. Just go to their website. I will leave the link in the description. Click this Invite button at the top left of the screen and choose the server where you want to add the bot. In my case, it will be this test one. This is the list of permissions you will give to the bot. Click the Authorize button and complete the CAPTCHA. Now the bot joined to your server. Next thing we need to do is create the roles. To do this, we will go to the server settings at the top left. Go to roles and start creating them. Modify the permissions if you need to. It depends on what you want the roles for. In my case, I will just create color roles so people can have colorful names. If you want to do this too, just create roles and choose any color you want. You can also choose a custom color that is not here. In my case, I don't like this red color, so I will open the palette and change it. Better now. Okay, so now I will start using the bot. I will create another channel named bot. I recommend you to have a private text channel for this kind of stuff. We will use the reaction role setup command. First of all, we will need to specify the channel where we want the message. In my case, I will create a new channel called roles. Now just put a title and description for the message with this format. The title for my message will be React to change your role. You can change it later. And if you put roles between brackets in the description, it will automatically add a list with all the roles and their emoji. Now it will ask if we want to include a color in our message. You can skip this by typing none. Or you can go into this website and search for your color. In my case, I will choose blue. Just copy this hex code right here and paste it. Lastly, add the emojis and roles you want. In my case, I will put colored hearts for them, so for the blue role, I will put a blue heart, and so on. The bot will react with a check mark, which means everything went good. To finish with the setup, type done, and now the bot automatically sent the message in our roles channel. If we react to the blue emoji, for example, it will give us the blue role and our name will be blue. If we remove the reaction, the role will be removed too. And if we react to multiple emojis, we will get all the roles, but the color will be the first role we picked. That's it for today. That's how easy you can create reaction roles on Discord in 2024. If this tutorial was helpful, please consider subscribing and leaving a like for more. Thanks for watching.